Take my Friends and families, we've come here today for the union of Gary and Evelyn to share in the joy of their wedding. This outward celebration that we shall see in here, I believe, is an expression of the love and devotion they have in their hearts toward one another. Evelyn and Gary come together today desiring to be united in this sacred relationship of marriage. And so now I would ask who is giving this woman to be married to this man. I do. Thank you, sir. The ceremony of marriage in which you come to be united is one of the first and oldest ceremonies in all the world, celebrated in the beginning in the presence of God himself. Marriage is a gift in that we give ourselves totally to one another. I believe marriage is a gift given to comfort the sorrows of life and to magnify life's joy. Marriage is the blending of two hearts, the union of two lives into one, and your marriage must stand not by the authority of the state, but by the strength and power of the faith and love you have in one another. <coughs> Evelyn and Gary, you've chosen to exchange rings as the sign and seal of the promises you're making for one another today. So These rings are made in a circle, and their design tells us that we must keep love continuous throughout our whole lives, even as the circle of the ring is. And as you wear these rings, whether you're together or apart for even just a moment, may they be a constant reminder of the promises you're making to one another today. And if you will, I'll have you pass your I'll have you guys turn and face one another and join hands to express your vows of love and devotion to the other. Gary, if you will, please take that face on the third finger of the eagle in his left hand. Mm -hmm. I, Gary, take you, Evelyn. I, Gary, take you, Evelyn. To be my wedded wife. To be my wedded wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer or for poor. For richer or for poor. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and cherish. To love and cherish. Until death do us part. Until death do us part. According to God's <laughs> holy order. According to God's holy order. And there too, I give you my love. There too, I give you my love. Third finger, Gary's left hand. And as you continue to hold his hand in yours, please repeat after me, saying, I, Evelyn, take you, Gary. I, Evelyn, take you, Gary. To be my wedded husband. To have and to hold. From this day forward. For better or for worse. For richer or for poor. In sickness and in health, to love and cherish, until death us do part, according to God's holy ordinance. And there too I give you my love. Let's bow our hearts in prayer. Heavenly Father, we thank you for this beautiful day, and we thank you for this union of Gary and Evelyn. And as they begin their journey together from this day forth, I pray blessings of health, happiness, harmony, and prosperity upon their life together. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 Gary and Evelyn, you come here today before us and before God.
and expressed your desire to become husband and wife. You've shown your love and affection by joining hands and made promises of faith and devotion each to the other. You've sealed these promises by the giving and the receiving of the rings. So may the Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. And therefore, by the power and authority vested in me, it is my privilege to announce that you are husband and wife. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Though God is joined together, together never let man put asunder. And Amen. Amen. Man kiss your lovely wife. <laughs> John, I'm going to kiss your sister. <laughs> <laughs>